Okay, guys, you know this is a war episode when I say this. War time! Hmm. So, guys, we are a drastic turning point in a war that I didn't really want. I mean, you guys... I don't even know why they declared war on me. I don't know what I did. Seriously, this is like one of those few times I'll say it. I don't know what I did, but apparently I made everyone angry again. So, yeah... That happens a lot, apparently, in these Let's Plays, so, yeah. Anyways, we're gonna be turning over our men to go gather them up into one big, gigantic, you know, cluster thing. And basically, what we're gonna try to do is, as long as we, because the only thing we really have to do is, as long as we defend St. James, right? Well, actually, they could use Muscovy. Oh, gosh, I didn't even think about them using Muscovy. Speaking of which, has Muscovy expanded? Yeah, they are expanding, like, like big, gigantic crazy people but that's beside the point um what I was gonna say is that we are gonna have to get up all of our armies so that we can go fight against frankly a bigger place than us I'm not gonna lie they are probably way bigger than us in terms of power, I'm not... Individually, they could probably stomp us out. Holy shoot, they already have a big army. How does that already happen? Yeah, this, this is what I mean. They have... Honestly, they have a big, gigantic army. But as long as I get a more... Okay, group up right there. I know it's gonna, have, like... Like, kill us, but... Get this army right here. We're going to use this army to go crush as much as we can. Prestige, good. I'm glad Jamaica is now on our side. Oh, wait. Whoops. I didn't mean that to keep continuing on. I'm sorry about the lag there, people. I did not mean that either. Okay, Santi. We can send it to Santi now. There we go. Now we got most of the shores cornered. Which goes at war with us, too? Oh, my good. Wait, that. How did I get war, Portugal? Let's, let's be real here, that was not even, they were not even in the original. Okay, now that's just cheap. That's just cheap. You can't just, like, include random people that weren't even supposed to be in this war. To be in this war. Okay. So I'm at war with Portugal too, so. Just on side notes, guys, we are at war with a lot more people than I thought we were. So let's see. We are at total war with all these people. I don't even know why I made Portugal so mad. Like, seriously! Okay, and Poland's mad at us, too. I don't know why, either. Like, I don't know what I did to make everyone mad. And I don't- Wait at this- Ah, shoot! Uh... What? Ah, gosh. I don't even know what's happening, but... I'm getting my- my butt kicked. Well, I guess, I guess that is what's happening, but I just want to make it clear to you people. This is like the worst moment in my life. I'm getting my butt kicked. And I'm getting chased by Lithuanians. This is probably the second worst thing that ever happened to me in a very long time. Luckily, my army is bigger than theirs, so I just have to wait for it to heal a little bit. Grant aid, non-family request, lose, grant aid. Okay. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna have to be really careful. So that means we're not only gonna have to deal with our ourselves, we're also gonna have to deal with our colonies. Gosh dang it! I was hoping those things were protected, but apparently not. And you're Bohemia, you're gonna get out of this pretty quickly. Mm. Just get inside. I don't care. You guys are basically defeated. Okay, I'm gonna get I'm gonna push them out of New St. James. That's what we need to do, okay? Basically, what my plan is going to be is I'm just going to hold New St. James and basically let them uh, exhaust their manpower on my wall, okay? Um, I'm also going to build up a little mini army, so let's see, I have 8 slots, so that means... Uh, no, I have 7 slots, so that means 4 to 1, so... 1... 
two, three. Actually, I'll make one more cannon. Because I do love cannons. They're like, they go boom. One, two. And then, we can build another cannon. I guess I can't build another cannon. So that's, that's going to be my new army in the background. And I'm just basically, what I'm basically going to do, guys, is they can't move in without going through there. Is going through New St. James. So if I just pinpoint them right there, then they're not going to be able to do anything. I mean, they could go all the way around here, but that's going to take a long time. And I doubt Hansa is going to let them. I don't even, why is Venice mad at me? Like, seriously, I'm just like thinking, why are some of these people mad at me? I don't remember ever making them mad. What did I ever do to Venice? Seriously, I want to know what I did to Venice, because successful bureaucracy. Oh my goodness, they are like. Uh, and if I decide, no, I'm gonna lose 10 bureaucracy because I need my money right now. Like seriously, it's just my mil- Uh, raise wartime taxes. Yeah, let's raise wartime taxes for a little bit. Okay. And let's get our new army up to speed. Yeah. Conversion successful. Yeah, this is a good thing. It's a good thing I'm also converting almost all my provinces like 20 times faster than normal. And I can't really, like I said, I can't really attack any of this over here because this is just... Okay, how much can this actually support in terms of manpower? Like... Hmm... How long would it take? 12 months. Would we have 12 months? I th think we would. Well, let me see. What's the supply limit? Okay, yeah. Supply limit. What's the supply limit over here? 35. So I need to divide two men. 36, 32. Okay, you two go over here. Okay. Now we're just gonna make a we're just gonna make a new fort in St. James. Yeah, I really can't. Right now, I basically cannot move in because they grouped all their soldiers and I cannot defeat that. Oh shoot. They're moving their soldiers, aren't they? Why are they just I, I don't know why Portugal is standing down Holdenstein. Holdenstein didn't join me in this war. Okay. But yeah. Okay, maybe one more less. Okay. We get out of here. Yeah, we're gonna need to keep at least 34 rounds. Alright, and we'll keep... Since they're building a level 2 fort, it should be fine. So yeah, all we have to do is just make sure that we can hold this line. My king, Bohemia, has accepted peace. And then, yeah, these guys are the ones I'm really gonna have to deal with. Because these guys are the ones that are completely angering me. And now they have a, a bigger, gigantic army than me. And they're not going to stop until they destroy everything. Alright, let me see. Is that 28k? I could maybe crush this quick enough. Wait, nope. Yeah, I'm not stupid, AI. I'm not going to attack unless I have an advantage. I mean, but I know you guys can't get through here until you guys defeat me. So I'm going to wait for you guys to spread out and maybe attack your lowest point. Hmm. And while this is going on, we have rebellions. But it's in my new lands. So I'm going to go destroy them with our massive, massively good control troops. Yeah, not landing. Good thing they're not landing anything on the Caribbean shores. Otherwise, I'd be completely angry right about now. Um, Portugal is finally starting to get into this whole fighting thing. I'm going to have to block them now. So I'm going to have to go send this army down here to go kill them. Oh, they have me blocked up. I can't actually get over there. Oh, wow. Good job, guys. You guys have completely blocked me up. Anyways, um, we have these guys right here doing all that they can. I'm going to wait for this. Okay. Go after them. Ah, dang it. Ah! I'm like... Surrounded. I cannot. I have to start killing some of these armies. Otherwise, I'm going to start dealing with problems. I know this. And I can't, still can't do anything. Call Ribbling. You guys are going to have to be our general for a second. I mean. Oh gosh. There we go. 
There's an opening. I see an opening. Oh wait, wait. Can't do fast march. You cannot order a station units to force march. Uh, sports death. Dang it. Okay, let's see if we can get right there. We might be able to. Yes. I think we're going to be able to do a lot of things here. Let's see, when you guys leaving, July 13th, July 13th, July 13th, no. Yeah, I'm not stupid enough to attack you guys when you're doing that. I'll attack these guys. Oh gosh, I am not... This is, this is turning into a kind of weird war. But the good thing is, is that as long as I can hold out long enough, I mean, I don't... Uh, that's basically, I best. That's basically what I have to do, guys. I just have to hold out long enough for this to turn into our favor. I mean, that's basically it. Now I'm gonna start colonizing over here too. That way I can get all this, like all this saying Scandinavia right here. I want to get Scandinavia big letters so I can get that. But back over here, yeah, it's kind of sad. I'm I'm getting a little bit constrained and I can't really attack. Because there's so many men around us. Now, what do you guys even want? So, I'll give it to you guys. Concede defeat. Is that what you guys want me to do? Maybe get as much dollars as I can give you? No, that's, you guys don't really want that. Uh, release stations or... Oh, wait. This is my... Wait, whoops. I mean, I was going to give up something. Sorry. Uh, concede defeat. Um, offer... Alright, and what if I release Finland? Would you guys accept it then? You know, Gotland, Finland. See, this is why I don't get about this AI, is that I offer them everything, they don't even accept. It's like... What am I greeting? Scandinavia will release Denmark as a sovereign state. Ha 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 no! Yeah, you guys are gonna have to, if you guys want Yeah, if you guys want that, you guys are definitely gonna have to fight me. I don't That's a little bit too you you guys are fooling yourself if I'm gonna let you guys do that. I mean I may not have the best of kin on me right now. But I know I could fight you guys off to that. That's just disgraceful. I would never give you guys that. Okay? Never. Oh, gosh. But that's really becoming an issue right now. I'm really having all these guys right here. Um, let's get some more cannons. Let's get some more of these guys right next to here. Just so that I can protect my men. Because they're right now in the war zone. Like, seriously. They're in the war zone right now, and I can't do anything about it because they're not moving any of the soldiers. Okay, okay, there we go. Okay, let's see, if we can we catch him? Yes! No! No, 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 no! What the? I'm gonna lose on that. Yep, I lost. Because they just managed to group up all the soldiers into one big gigantic chunk, which then defeated me. This, and now they're gonna get a fleeing rain into my country. Why do you guys always go down to Skalane? Good job for converting. And I feel like as soon as... The, I'm, I'm kind of mad if you guys haven't noticed because that's... This was that alliance thing I was talking about. Eventually I knew it was gonna catch up to me, but... It comped to me a lot quicker than I expected. Like, honestly. Come to me slightly quicker than I expected. And now I don't think, and I'm gonna be honest here, I don't think I have enough to go deal with all these troops that are gonna be rushing through to my land. Um. I'm gonna have you get back onto the main. Okay, get back onto the mainland. Seriously, we need you guys back on the mainland. There we go. Alright, um. I'm not sure how I'll be able to deal with that yet. We're just gonna have to fight Shadow Wars over here. Okay. Because I'm not gonna be able to... I'm just gonna have to wait for them to come inside. Basically what a Shadow War, guys, is, if you guys don't know, is I'm gonna basically have... Well, maybe this is not what a Shadow War means. 
but this is what kind of means to me is I'm basically gonna have to fight and just kind of attack and and go back attack and go back attack and go back for like the longest of time I won't really have oh my goodness this is why I've wanted for a long time uh, gosh no we need to we need to save up all of our stuff because we need to get that we need to get that administration thing but yeah I'm just gonna basically gonna attack retreat attack retreat attack retreat attack retreat I'm not gonna do anything else because so we don't have much. We we honestly don't have much. I know that. I'm not stupid. The natives are restless. It's a comment. Yep. Of course. Get that. Yeah. I already. I'm not stupid. I already know we're not. We're not gonna be able to fight against these guys. So I'm just going to just declare to just try to defend myself. And are you guys still building or? Building is 57 days away, so in uh, less than that, uh, accommodations, it's the utmost, yeah, defensiveness would be really nice right about now. Okay, we're well, losing money at an astounding rate, just keep going down from there, yeah, this is not looking the best, the Portuguese aren't helping either. I mean, quite honestly, the Portuguese are one of the main reasons why we are having difficulties. Oh, gosh. What happened to my allies? That's all I gotta say. Okay, we're gonna go send our men to go help our soldiers. I mean, why are we not winning this? I don't understand why we're not winning. Did I forget to upgrade my armies again? No, free soldiers is exactly what we needed. Why are we losing so badly? I mean, it makes no sense to me. Hmm. Maybe you can kind of... No, this is not going to work. What am I doing? I'm just going to block him. Indeed, spice, peppers. Oh gosh, I can't do much. I can't technically move in and I can't technically move out. This is like a bad position to be in. Yeah, they're moving with their death stack armies and I can't do anything about it. Oh gosh. Okay. I'm gonna go right there. That should win. That should win. Yes. 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 We won a battle. Finally. It took us like a long time, but we finally won a battle. Shouldn't I get war score and in terms us? Yeah, I got Battle of Volburg. So I finally won a battle. That means we can finally start turning the tide. Gonna wait for them to do whatever. Actually, I'll divide my army and just go hunt them down myself. So I'm not letting them escape. So yeah, this army in the back, this this Lithuanian army is gonna die. Now it's in the back. A peace offer from Poland, white peace. Except, fine, yes! Okay. So now Poland's out, Pomerania, could you guys get out too? Sue for peace. Offer tributes. Stare demand. So yeah, these guys are out. If I get Pomerania out, I could definitely do a lot of things. Portuguese, they look like they want to stay and just try to fight me as much as possible. Now, how much are the actual army? they're going to be a pain in the butt if they have a big gigantic army. I'm just going to be honest. So actually let's start by country. Back would be a little bit quicker. Portugal, 28,000. So we can basically consider this is the entire army. So once we go destroy these guys, I think I'm going to retreat and then go deal with the rest of um, Portugal. Okay, and they got right there, go right there, go right there, we're gonna go deal with these guys. Okay, I mean, we're losing, but we're not. Let's see, where are they going to? Kexcom, go right there. I mean, we are losing, guys, I won't deny that, but we aren't really losing. I'm waiting for, they're not going to Kexcom, good. Okay, good, destroy this army. Oh, shoot. 
They weren't going to just come. Oh, guys. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to win this war because I made too many. Why, why are you guys going all the way down there? I don't understand that. You guys are supposed to be grabbing. Oh, gosh. I'm going to lose this war so hardcore. Oh, gosh. Um, Medium, would you guys like to... A member of the coalition cannot separate. Yeah, let's see. How about you guys, Lithuania? Would you guys like peace? Would you guys like peace now? No, you guys are still not... You guys are still wanting to go to war with me. Okay. I'm just knowing... I'm just trying to figure out where our term stands. Okay. Okay, let's go. Destroy some of these Portuguese over here. Okay, native accommodations with. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, we're gonna have to go deal with. There are way. Yeah, there are way too many Portuguese over here. Let's go. Let's go fight some of these guys off. I mean, seriously, the Portuguese have been allowed way too much freedom over here. And I honestly think they are becoming way too numerous. Get onto the mainland, get onto the mainland, get onto the mainland. That island, I don't know why I own it, kind of. Let's go start destroying some of these Portuguese armies. Um, yeah, let's just start destroying some of these guys. These guys are starting to become annoying. Bilberg. That should win. It has my leader. I mean, even with their men, they should not be able to win. Of utmost importance, I guess. Go right here. Well, let's go right here and then go. What? You gotta be kidding me. No way. No way are the Portuguese winning. I was about to say, there's no way those Portuguese are gonna be winning. Alright. What I'm gonna what I'm gonna try to do is get Portugal out of the war. Cause I think we need Portugal out of the war before anything happens. Let's see, where are they going to? Skelane? Stay exactly here. Oh, well, they're going even further in. Chase them. Let's get some of our land back. But I think we need to destroy some of the land in Skelane before we can start dealing with the Ivonian order again. Because we're gonna need to we need to make we need to kinda of get them out of here. Basically. That's basically what I'm trying to get get as. We have to get them out of here. So you have to wait for ah, uh, Livonian order. You guys are like blocking me severely. Okay, well I'm gonna go send my men to go kill you guys. Cause you guys are blocking me. Like that's actually a pretty good strategy. Just blocking. Okay, let's just speed it up a little bit. Let's go kill these guys. Naval suffering as expected. Yeah, now they're dead. I mean. They're not sending that many soldiers into my land, which is kind of weird. War exhaustion. Wow, they are taking severe amounts of war exhaustion. Uh, sore, sore for the war enthusiasm. Mine's low, so I definitely want to get out of this war as quickly as possible. Stockholm. I'm probably going this way. Um, I'm going to have to wait for Portugal to come back over here, aren't I? And where's the revolt? Is it somewhere nearby? Because I'm going to have to crush it, aren't I? Let me see, is any, anyone over here, by the way? No one's in my colonies, that's good, but the revolt's somewhere over here, isn't it? Yeah, it's probably somewhere in those places that were lost to me. <laughs> uh, which is fine by me, they can... Oh yeah, you guys can have that, I don't really care. <laughs> that has been one of those places that has been revolting against me forever. Okay, let's see. Two, six, no, not even with the combined efforts can they beat me. Oh gosh, why am I morale so terrible? That just made me like cringe. We're gonna lose because of bad morale. Really. That is just. Okay, guys, seriously, recover. Whatever you guys have to do, recover. I don't know what the heck happened there. Oh gosh, we just like flatly died. I don't know what happened. Okay, I don't know what happened there either. That's just like a stupid battle no matter what you do. 
Yeah. Okay, peace out from Lithuania. Uh, Scandinavia will succeed without Scandinavia will give course to the Scandinavia will give course to uh, Scandinavia will give core will give core to Norway. This peace costs 100 million uh, gains and suffers. So let's see. Scandinavia will concede the core of Borm to Pomerania. They're out of the war though. Hmm. Oh shoot, I'm over time. So guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.